Hello, hi, my name is Juliana. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I really wanted to rank the KLA perfumes that I own. So I currently own, let's see, I currently own four fragrances from the brand and clearly I love it because four fragrances, that is a lot. So I wanted to, you know, revisit them, see what I like about them, see which one is my favorite. Obviously, I already know my favorite, but I wanted to tell everyone, so keep watching. Okay, so in spot number five, we have Kelly Elixir, Elixir um, 11. Let's see. The reason as to why this is on my number 11 is because it has that tobacco knot that I just, I don't know, it's not my vibe. When I look at, when I look on Fragrantica, I don't see any tobacco in it, but I smell it. I don't know if it's maybe the mixture with, the mixture of patchouli and a little bit of fruity that's producing a tobacco knot to my nose, but I still like it. I just, it's my list. In the ones that it's my least liked in the ones that I own right now it pairs well with um, Tom Ford for the winter so maybe I'll try that again when it's colder and see you know if it's still at the top uh, at, the, <laughs> at the bottom sorry I'm again on number three is the invite only amber 23 now this, I know why I bought it. Cause when you smell it, you just can't help but love it, right? It is a very good perfume. It is like, it, the amber was done absolutely beautifully. It's, I feel like the bottle really kind of shows you what to expect. Cause this, this smells like pure royalty. Oh my goodness love it love 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 it um love it it's mm, okay it's everything it's such it's such okay yeah i got this it's such a good date night scent or maybe any um any evening out kind of scent this this will have people asking you what on earth are you wearing i love it our number two spot, we have Deja Vu. Now, let's see, I kind of forgot how this smells. This is my number two because it's so versatile, in my opinion. Everything is in my opinion. <laughs> it's so versatile. Um, this can go to work. This can go to the gym. This can go run errands. I love it for springtime. Springtime on my morning walks, this is probably my go-to. I think they did such a good job. Of, I mean, which, which fragrance of theirs did they not do a good job on? Let's talk about it. Because they come up with banger after banger after banger. I mean, Kelly, you're doing a really good job. But uh, the Deja Vu, it has the tubers, it has the white florals, but then it's also slightly sweet, slightly musky. So it's giving you, oh, I stepped out of the shower and this is how, this is what my shower smells like, right? Like I didn't try that hard. This is just, this is just me existing. Deja Vu, love it. And on the top number one spot for me from Kaeli at this moment has to be vanilla 28. Oh, vanilla 28 is mm. this when they talk about the you know the amount of sugar spice carnival and cinnamon this is what i'm wearing because this is plain sugar this is telling you i am sweet i'm just a sweet girl you know but you know i'm not that innocent I know, I know stuff, you know, but I'm sweet. I'm always going to be sweet. This is, mm, mm, mm. this I think 
in my entire fragrance collection could rank in the top 10 and that's saying a lot you know vanilla 28 is so so versatile it can be paired with so many other fragrances it can be worn alone and every single time at least one person is going to comment on how good you smell that at least one person is going to take a deep whiff when you walk by at first i was like hmm guys that, that's creepy then i'm like you know what i mean i'm going to serve the people what the people want right <laughs> okay i'll leave vanilla 28 ranks top ranks number one for me when it comes to the Kelly fragrances that I own. If you have stayed till the end of this video, thank you so, so much for staying. Thank you so much for watching. And if you own any Kelly perfumes, I would love to know which ones. Thank you so much and have a good day. Bye.